As many requests, today I gonna show you how to train object on cascade method. Then you can easy to get recognition any objects you want such as license plate, car, motor, human. If we follow instruction from OpenCV it's quite complicated special with window users. On this video I will share the simple application with very nice interface, you can easily to train your object in 3 minute. To start the training, you need to create a folder for your classifier. Create two folders inside it. One should be P, for positive images, and the other should be N, for negative images. Positive image samples are the images of the object you want to train your classifier and detect. For example, if you want to train and detect the cup then you need to have many cup images. And you should also have many negative images. Negative images are anything but cups. Important note 1, negative images must never include any positive images. Not even partially. Start by pressing the browse button in train tab. Select the folder you have created for the classifier. Common, cascade and boost tabs can be used for setting numerous parameters for customizing the classifier training. Next you need to set the sample width and height. Make sure not to set it to a very big size because it will make your detection very slow. Actually it is quite safe to always set a small value for this. Recommended settings for sample width and height is that you keep one aspect on 24 and set the other accordingly. As for the parameters in the boost tab, it is recommended to keep the default values unless you are quite sure about what you're doing. After all the parameters are set, press start button at the bottom to start training your cascade classifier. You'll see the following lock screen while training is going on. Important note 2, in theory, negative images can be any image that is not the positive image but in practice, negative images should be relevant to the positive images. For example, using sky images as negative images is a poor choice for training a good car classifier, even though it doesn't have a bad effect on the overall accuracy. We got cascade.xml as the actual cascade classifier and if the training completed successfully then you should have this file inside classifier folder. To test your classifiers, go to test tab from the tab bar at the top and set the options as described below and finally press start. Select your cascade classifier using the browse button at the top. You can also manually enter the path to cascade xml file in the cascade classifier xml field. This cascade classifier will be used for detection in images and slash or videos. You can select single image will be used as the scene in which detection will be done. In this case path should point to a single image file. Only supported images can be selected. Set got some wearing about set the minimum and maximum size for object detection. That's good to remove none object recognition. As you can see, the cups detected, however still some noises on background still detected as cups. So that meaning we need more background negative image and more real sample positive image for training. Thanks for your watching. Like and subscribe to follow and support channel.